All right, so it's an interesting new initiative that the government is toying with, but there's uh, yet more that the government is thinking of, and this time it's a regulator for the realty space. Given the fact that there has been a fair amount of controversy in the real, real estate industry over the past couple of years, this is perhaps not surprising. But the big question is whether or not the corporates involved are going to be liking the situation very much. Rajat Guha brings you all the angles of the story. The real estate sector is all set to get a regulator soon. After four years of deliberations and strong lobbying by realty players on the final provisions of the bill, NDTV learns that the bill is finally ready to be placed in the cabinet. This is being taken up on uh, priority now. Uh, basically, since uh, this ministry would be administering issues relating to the Union territory, our idea is to have this drafted for um, uh, Delhi uh, and, and um, take it for a decision uh, for the legislation, legislative part of it. But several strict provisions that were initially planned have been dropped from the bill. There is no mention of heavy penalties and jail term for erring builders and no provisions to enforce distinction on pricing between built-up and carpet area. And licenses will be issued by state instead of regulator. HDFC was the first one to suggest measures to bring in transparency in pricing. They said that uh, ideally the builders should be selling on a, on a carpet area basis rather than a super, super built-up area basis because there's no transparency in these things. And ultimately at the end of the day, the order of the day is transparency. However, there remain some provisions in the new bill to hem in real estate developers. Under the bill, reality players will need license to operate and pre-launch sale of property will not be allowed. Property buyers can seek refund if builders fail to comply and government will have power to cancel license of property developer on violations. Insurance of property will be mandatory on part of the realtor. No, this is not possible. It is not possible because if the project has already gone to a substantial level and the delays have happened due to government clearances or for any other reason which was beyond the control of the developer, then it, how he can bring in the money to refund to the customers at that stage. It is still left to be seen how far the law could be implemented if at all it gets cabinet approval as land is a state subject and would need active participation from the states. In New Delhi, with Rajat Guha, Saurabh Chakravarti for NDTV Profit.